So I prophesied as he commanded me. And the breath came into them. And they lived and stood up upon their feet. An exceeding great art. Boom! Loud as a trumpet trying to reach the people Sculptors, naysayers, you hypocrites And keep it one damn law, your honor with your lips Blind guys leading the blind into a pit You two fold the child of hell, then your pastor is Once a people with no mercy, we will bath the kids All praises to the Father, we've been wrecking sealed We birth resurrected and regenerated Sin using flesh, cover bones that were naked This holy Bible is the antidote to heal the people But we still some stiff neck and rebellious children That the enemy is very crafty, right? right? I'm about to show you according to the Bible, the scriptures that tells you that the enemy is very, very crafty. First, give me Nehemiah 5 and 9. You know? We're going to make you understand time and time again who your enemy is. Nehemiah 5 and 9. Nehemiah chapter 5 and verse 9. Read. Also, I said, it is not good that ye do, are ye not to walk in the fear of our God. So aren't you not supposed to walk in the fear of the Most High God? Not talking to everybody, only the 12 tribes of Israel. Right. Because of the reproach of the heathen. The what? The heathen. The heathen of the other nations. Who are they? Our enemies. No, our friends. Our enemies. The heathen are your enemies. That's right. Just like we said in Deuteronomy 28. Now, with them being your enemies, if I knew that you were a God on this earth, would I tell you? I will not tell you. I will tell you things to keep you on the bottom. That's what they did today. That's what they do in the school system. That's what they do in the commercials. That's what they do in VH1, BET, rap music. They do the same thing and corrupt our generation after generation. Read. Psalms 83 and verse 2. Uh -huh. For lo, thy enemy, the heathen, make a tumult. Make a tumult, an angry gathering. They come together. Just like the UN and the United Nations, NATO, they make a tumult. They came together. We. And they that hate thee. And they that what? Hate thee. No, we all a family. Hate thee. They that hate thee. We. Have lifted up their head. They are very, very cocky. Just like Conor McGregor and Ronda Rousey. They are very, very cocky. They lifted up their head because they know that they have you in tribute. We. They have taken crafty counsel. They have taken crafty counsel. So if I'm taking crafty, if I'm doing crafty against you, that means that I'm doing secretly. Uh, I'm doing this secretly this with you. So they're taking crafty counsel against who? Against thy people. Against these 12 tribes. They tell you that you are African American. They tell you that you are Hispanic. They tell you that you are Mexican. You are the 12 tribes of Israel. They tell you that you are West Indian. But that just means West slave. That's all that means. They have taken crafty counsel against thy people and consulted against the hidden ones. I consulted against the hidden ones. Who are the hidden ones? The 12 tribes of Israel. Because our people don't know who the hell they are. Right. They're walking around dead. Give me that, Revelation 11 and 8. They're walking around dead, man. A dead mindset. Not physically dead, but dead spiritually and mentally. Read. Revelation chapter 11 verse 8. Uh -huh. And their dead bodies. Question. Are any of us laying on the ground right now? So their dead bodies, the there are the 12 tribes of Israel. It says their dead bodies, dead spiritually, reap, shall lie in the streets of the great city. Shall lie in the streets of the great city. What is that great city? Babylon the Great, the United States of America. Right, right, right. Which spiritually is called Sodom and Egypt. Which spiritually is called Sodom and Egypt. This is the same place where homosexuality is deemed good. This is the same place where we were in slavery in Egypt, we're in slavery today. Get out! That's where we're at. Psalm 83. Psalm chapter 83 and verse 3. They have, they have taken crafty counsel against thy people uh -huh. and consulted against the hidden ones. Uh -huh. They have said. They have said. So after they have came together, 
and taking crafty counsel they got, and make think tanks. Understand, they make think tanks on what to put on certain television stations and commercials in certain areas. The point is, is this, if I know, if we know that eating pork is bad according to the Bible, right? What commercials come out in the hood? Parties, the double bacon burger. But what come out in the so-called suburbs? Vegan restaurants. They put sin upon you. They take crafty counsel. Bruh, Read. They have said, come and let us cut them off from being a nation. So they said, come, let us cut them off from being a nation. Let's make them forget about their history. Let's give them VH1. Let's give them love of hip hop. Let's give them Black Lives Matter. Black lives go to the matter of black lives. That's right. So let's give them certain things to distract them from what? The truth. The truth according to these scriptures. The truth saying that you are God's upon this earth, you're God's chosen people. Right. Free. That the name of Israel. That the name of who? That the name of Israel. Not the name of African American. That the name of Israel. The name of Mexico. The name of Israel. That the name of Israel. May be no more in remembrance. Because these other names are in remembrance. Your name changes every 10 years. So do you remember these days? You remember Afro-American. You remember Black. You remember Jamaican. But the name of Israel is no longer in remembrance because of what? The crafty counsel that our enemies took against us. Now the only reason why these people are able to do this to us is because we broke God's commandments. That's right. You understand? So let's get some commandments that our people break on a daily basis. Yeah. Give me uh, Leviticus 18, 22. Matter of fact, give me Numbers 15, 30. Let's deal with this right here. Let me see something that's on every one of these brothers and officers and captains right here. We have something called fringes on the borders of our garment. They're kind of cool, right? They fly. That's your history. That's your heritage. Read. Numbers chapter 15 and verse 38. Speak unto the children of Israel. What you want to understand is that the main audience in this whole entire book is the nation of Israel. It's not talking to everybody else. That's it's not right. with the other nations. The only time it's dealing with the other nations is their destruction. Read. Right. And bid them and command them that they make them fringes in the borders of their garments. So a part of your repentance, you must change up your lifestyle as well as your clothing. Right. Our women got to come out those pants and wear modest apparel. Our men, and they got to wear fringes as well. And we got to put fringes on the borders of our garments. But it's a reason why God told us to put fringes on our garments. You know? Throughout their generations. Throughout the generations. Are you always having, are we always having children? If you have a child after you, that's your generation. And that's his generation. So he says the word fringes throughout our generations. That means forever. Read. And that they put upon the fringe of the borders a ribbon of blue. Read. And it shall be upon you for a fringe. This is the meaning of the fringes. It's just not to be fly. Read. That ye may look upon it. That you may look upon it. I can look upon these fringes right now, right? I can see that they're on my garment. Read. And remember all the commandments of the Lord. So these fringes are to make you remember the commandments of the Lord. Because the point is, is this, not all of our people are repentant. So it's some women out here that's out here in tight jeans. You may be battling with lust, but you look at that, her body, and you have to remember, hey, I can't do that. I gotta remember that she's not committed adultery. I can't look upon my sister that way. This is a reminder. You understand? So what your brothers got to do in the middle of your repentance and understand that you're an Israelite is get fringes on the borders of your garments. That's right. You understand that? That's, a, that's another part. Uh, uh, give me... Yeah, read that. And, the top of here, 39. and it shall be upon you for a fringe that you may look upon it and remember all the commandments of the Lord. Remember and all the commandments of the Lord. Not just some of them. Because the Christian church teaches you just to keep some commandments. Hell, they don't even teach you to keep no commandments. Corporal Dollar told you that if you keep the commandments, you're in the midst of sin. Right. That's madness. But the Bible says that if you want to keep, if you keep the commandments, you'll get the kingdom of heaven. That's letting you know that Christianity is a total lie. Newsflash. Christianity is of the devil. That's right. Read. Remember all the commandments of the camera, Lord boss, and do them. Remember all the commandments the of the Lord and do them. You understand that? So, brother, hey, what's your name, man? Uh oh, my name. What's your name, man? Uh oh, good question. Jesus loves you. Hey, go back. I'm right here. Hey, hey, you asked me my name, yo. Give me that, uh, hey, I got good Give news. Chapter 15 Jesus and loves verse 40. Let's finish this. That ye may remember. I'm right here. And oh, do man. all my commandments. You want to know my name? And be holy yo. unto your 
God. Hey, I'm right here. Go to your God. Go to your God. Go. God is only you your asked God. me my name. So the question is, what? has sure. churches ever told you that God is everybody's God? So they told you that God is everybody's God. I'm trying to talk to him like a man. Understand that? Give me I gotta Joel talk to the crowd. I gotta let you, you know, understand? Guys. Jesus loves you. Satan knows that you're getting Jesus the truth right now. You. But we're going to show you according to the Bible who you are. Regardless of what's going on. That we shall repent and come to the kingdom of Joel, God. Joel, chapter Jesus 2 and verse 27. Uh -huh. And you shall know that I am in the midst of Israel. I'm in the midst of everybody. In the midst of Israel. No, I'm in the midst of every other nation. In the midst of Israel. We. And that I am the Lord your God. What is your? Yours is a possessive pronoun. It's showing that I have possession, right? I am the Lord your God. And none else. And none else. It's point blank, period. God is only the God of the nation of Israel. We. And my people shall never be ashamed. So you should never be ashamed to take your hat off when the scripture's coming at you. That's right. You should right. never be ashamed to wear fridge on board of your garment. Right. You should never be ashamed to say, I'm not celebrating these pagan holidays no more. Right. You right. should never be ashamed to say that Jesus I love people you. than any Jesus other people on this earth. Jesus says, 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 Jesus says
Jesus. Let the Bible said, let's all that do is come in. The blood of Jesus. Listen, come on. The blood of Jesus. They shall not make bones. They shall not make bones. They shall not make bones. Upon their head. Upon their head. Neither. 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 Neither.
The blood of Jesus. He wants your brain. The blood of Jesus. Give me more. The blood of Jesus. 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 Come on. The blood of Jesus. The children of Israel. The blood of Jesus. 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 Yes, 
to these brothers to teach them the Bible? Come on. And in thy name have cast out devils. Come on. And in thy name done many wonderful works. Come on. And then See, because in, in their mind they think they're doing the works of the most high. They not. Come on. And then will I profess unto you as the devil. Christ go profess unto every single one of these bastards what? I never knew you. I I don't know you. That's what Christ is going to say. I never knew you. I didn't give you our daily bread. I gave you the Bible. The book of Matthew chapter 7 verse 23. Come on. And then will I profess unto them. Then will Christ profess unto these bastards that scream the blood of Jesus with no Bible. Come on. I never knew you. I never knew you. That's right. I never knew you. Come on. Depart from me, ye that work iniquity. Get the hell away from me. What's your daily bread? That daily bread will burn right along this place. Yes, Lord. You two to follow this God. I'm going to miss this land. Hey, I'm going to follow this. He's up there clapping right now. He's up there clapping right now. He's up there clapping right now. We're reading you the Bible, the mouth of God. The blood of Jesus. Giving the greatest understanding out there. He's supposed to be out here teaching. Give me that joke. He's supposed to be out here. He's the age man. He's supposed to be out here teaching us. That's we all going to the Bible. What's required of us as men? Because it's obvious our community don't know what it is. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. If you're a man. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. Man, look me in my eye. That's the what blood of Jesus. That's what it means the to be a man. Blood of Jesus. Let's see what it means to be the a man. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. Job. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. Chapter 32, verse 7. Bring it out. I said, they should speak. God said, these old pastors should be able to give us understanding. They should be able to speak to us and educate us. They should speak. The blood of Jesus. And multitude of years should Teach wisdom. So these old men should be able to give you wisdom. Come on. But there is a spirit in man. Come on. And the inspiration of the Almighty gives them understanding. Come on. Great men are not always wise. Oh, are not always wise. Come on. Neither do the ends understand judgment. The blood of Jesus. Of what they're doing. Philippians 121, my life works. Great men are not is always wise. Neither do the age understand judgment. I don't understand judgment. So guess what? Philippians 121. He said, Philippians 121. Look, look at me. Talk to these men. Look at me. Talk to this man. Talk to me. 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 Look at me. I'm disrespectful. Philippians 121. This one is trying to learn the Bible. Learn the Bible. Black man. Read your Bible. Read your Bible. Read your Bible. Brother, step to the You look at me. Hey, what's your name again? Look at me, Captain. Look at me. Look at me. Look at me. I'm right here. I'm right here. You're right. I will die for this. Philippians 121. For me to live is Christ and to die is gain. You're right, Captain. I live by Jesus. I die for Jesus. Who will you die for? This heresy. This blood be upon your hands. That blood be upon your hands. Look at me. Look at me, Captain. Captain. Come on. Look at me. I go the way the blood of all the Jesus. The blood of Jesus. Of Jesus. Come on. The blood of Jesus. Therefore, the blood of show Jesus. Show thyself, Amen. So look, look at me, Cap. Cap. Strong. Cap. Look at me. In my show yourself. That blood gonna be on your hands. Keep the trust. That blood gonna be on your hands. To walk in His ways. The blood. To keep His statutes and His commandments and His judgments and His testimonies. You are here. It is written in the law of Moses. You know what a heretic is? A heretic preaches heresy. That's what you are. That, that blood is going to be on your hands. That blood is going to be on your hands. Repent, Captain. Captain, repent. Today could be the day. Today could be the day, Captain. Today could be the day. If any man teach otherwise, teach otherwise. If any man teach contrary, you are a heretic. You're preaching heresy and consent not 
to wholesome words. You don't get sent to the wholesome you words of this Bible. Come on. Even you the words of our Lord you Jesus Christ. Isn't this the, the blood of, of Jesus. Jesus Christ? The blood of we Jesus. The, the, the blood of Jesus. Where's the Christ? blood of Christ Jesus. Christ about? The blood. The it's all testament. about the blood. The, the, of the Lamb of God. God. He's saving us. The Lamb of God. Contrary to the law that Christ Man looking for an apple. And to the doctrine. Which is according to godliness. He don't care to the doctrine. Can't which is according to I'm godliness. To tell you He's according to the doctrine. Repent, which is a uh, 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 I daily bread. Repent. Come on. Repent, Captain. He is proud. He is what? Proud. Your brother is very proud. Come on. Knowing nothing. The Bible says you know nothing. That's right. But doting about blessings. He's doting about blessings. Repent. Repent for the living God. Now, if you're a man, look me in the eyes. Look me Jesus in the eyes. Say, Talk to me. What, what scripture do you call? Yes, sir. What scripture John 3, 16. God what scripture do you Romans 10, 9. Romans, Romans 10, 9. Call? You know the Bible. So John what does it say? John 3, 16. Get, no, read Romans 10, 9. Romans 10, 9. Romans Romans 10, 9. Give me Romans but 10, 9. But Cody, about Give me Romans 10, 9. And strength of words. Strength of the words. Try to entangle us in our speech. You want to come with the words? Strength of words. Come on, preach the words. Words. Stop preaching Not with God's words. Damnable heretics. See, because we can talk You're about the scriptures. You are a heretic. Look me in my eyes. Look me in my eyes. Damnable heresy. That blood is upon you. Right now could be the day of salvation. You don't know the day of You don't know the day of salvation. You don't know the day of salvation. Psalms 119 and 11. Are you going to get tested? What's that? That's the heart. 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 Out of the heart of the man, we're talking about the heart now, right? Proceed, evil thoughts. Repent, evil thoughts. Tonight could be the night, Captain. What are thoughts coming from? Tonight could be the night. So he's dumb as hell, what? He's an idiot. He's dumb as hell, He's the heretic that don't know nothing about the scripture. Right. Fuck out your mind. Give me first Corinthians 11. Give you the blood. You need the blood, Captain. Let me show you You need the blood. He's doing everything. You need the blood. You need Paul. You need the blood. You need Paul. I love Paul. And you need Paul. I love Paul. Wow. I love Paul. You read Timothy. Read the book of Timothy. Read the book of Timothy. You read Timothy. Yes, sir. What does it say? What does it say? What does it say? You're going to die. You're going to die. You're going to die. I want to quote you from my father. Oh, really? Oh, you're still going to die. I love you, Captain. The book of Timothy. That's Corinthians chapter 11, verse 3. Come on, can I have you know? All that blood. That the head of every man. All that blood. So your head of every man is Christ. I got good news. Christ can save you. And the head of the woman is the man. The blood. The head of the woman is the man. The blood. The head of the woman. So it's Christ, man, woman. Come on. And the head of the woman is God. Jesus, man, Jesus. And the head of Christ is God. Jesus saved. God, Christ, man, woman. Do you want to be saved tonight? Do you want to be saved tonight? Every man pray or prophesy. Every man praying or prophesy. Say Jesus say. I'm gonna tell you how you can say. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. His head. The blood of Jesus. You notice that it's cold out, right? The blood of Jesus. And we're teaching the Bible. Do we got our hats? The blood of Jesus. Why do you think that is? The blood of Jesus. Because we ain't going to cover your dog on head. That's right. That's right. That's right. Stop taking it out of context. He's just stop taking it out of context. He's talking about in church. Stop taking the word of God out of context. Jesus Christ saves when he's covering his head. The blood of Jesus. Why you got on hoodies? The first Look at the hypocrite. We got on hoodies. We got on hoodies. We got on hoodies. I see you walking every day with the hoodies on. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That's right. I know you are. You can't stand the truth. Right. You can't stand the truth. I love you. Right. I love you, I love you. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. I love you. I see the hate. I love you. You can see my heart. Your really? Is your mind. Really? Yes. Every time you speak, out of your bullets to the heart, the mouth speaks. Oh, 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 the blood of Jesus. Oh, Listen, oh, Captain. The book Captain. of First Samuel. The blood of Jesus. First twenty-three. The blood of Jesus. 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 You are rebellious.
the laws against of God. Who? Against, against you. Against, 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 against the laws of God. You God. You are rebellious you against God. the laws of God. You are rebellious against the laws of God. Stop taking his word out of context. Stop taking it out of context. Chapter 15, verse 23. Come on. For rebellion is as the sin of witchcraft. The blood of Jesus. 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 Chapter 12, verse 6. Come on. For the most high. Hate the blood of Jesus. Jesus. Well, I know the blood of Jesus. For the most high. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. For the most high. For the most high. Hate the blood of Jesus. For the most high. For the most high. Hate the blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. For the most high. For the most high. Hate the blood of Jesus. For the most high. For the most high. Hate the blood of Jesus. Most High God. Read on. 
But Elimus, the sorcerer, Elimus, that's called the Elimus. Elimus, the sorcerer, that's who he is. He the heart, for so was his name by interpretation, withstood them, seeking to turn away the deputy from the faith. Seeking to turn away what? The deputy from the faith. He's seeking to turn away leaders of the faith. He's seeking to turn away his people from the faith. Wait a Then Saul. Then who? Then Saul. Who also was called Paul. Filled with the Holy Ghost. Set his eyes on him. I tell you what. This brother comes up here and keep talking about, look at me. Look at me. I tell you what. Right now, every one of us, let's give him what he wants. Put your eyes on the brother right now. Look at him running away. Look at him. He's leaving now. Put your eyes on him right now. Look at me. Read on. Joshua 6. And said, And said, Oh, fool of all subtlety. Oh, fool of all subtlety. And all mischief. And all mischief. Thou child of the devil. Thou child of the devil. Thou enemy of all righteousness. Thou enemy of all righteousness. Will thou not cease. Will thou not cease to pervert the right ways? To pervert the right ways of the Lord. Of the Lord. And with that, I say shalom. Shalom, Israel. I'm Elder Nathaniel, Israel United in Christ. YouTube likes to shut our channels down, as some of you have noticed, <laughs> ever so often. Subscribing to join IUIC will assure you will always stay connected to our YouTube accounts. We want to do our best to make sure this truth gets out. Please click and join our subscriber YouTube channel called Join IUIC to stay linked to all of our videos. So again, Please make sure you subscribe to this join IUIC channel to get your latest updates from all our YouTube channels. Shalom.